Hey y'all, this is Dino. Welcome to my channel. I'm back with a quick, quick craft fair idea for you. Super simple. These could be like dollar items, but it's a money holder. Like you do gift card holders. These are money holders. So let me just show you quickly. I tied this one together with twine. You could put a belly band if you want, but I made it where you can write a greeting up here, put the money down here. You would tie it together with twine or put a belly band around it. Or you could put the greeting on the back. It's whatever you choose. Let me show you quickly how to do this. Y'all, you could do these in five minutes. Okay, so you're going to cut your paper at seven by seven and a half. And on the seven and a half inch side, you're going to score it two and a quarter and five and a quarter. That's it for the scoring. That easy. I made these a couple of years ago, and um, they're a great addition to craft fair. I ran across my own video, um, looking through some of my stuff, and I'm like, oh, I love to make in those. So let's make it again. So there we go. How easy is that, right? You can put a piece of paper on the inside if you want, but I'm going to leave it. Um, now all you're going to need is some decorative paper. So I've already pre-cut my decorative paper, and this one measures six and three-fourths by, let's see, two and two and an eighth and you're just going to put it right here but just measure it right up inside right up inside here okay it'll be perfect and you could just grab your wet glue or your tape or whatever I'm just going to get this on put it on the top Uh, the wet glue kind of gives you a second to wiggle it around here. And you can even go out a little bit farther if you want. I did six and three fourths. That's up to you. And then I have another one, the same size. This is a two. This one's actually about two inches by six and three fourths. And it's going to be right down here. So let's get this on. This one right down here. The other side of the paper is just absolutely darling, except I really loved the little checkered print too. So then I've already I've cut also a piece, and this one is two, two um two and a quarter by six and three fourths, and this goes uh, right up inside here. And I think I cut it too big. I need to cut it down. I'm going to cut this one down to two inches. So six and three fourths by two inches. That is how many times in a row I've miscut? That's okay. Okay, so this one actually is going to go right up here, and this is so you can write a greeting. So I'm going to get that glued down. right on that fold you want to make sure you have a little little bit of space get that right up in there I have some super cute little stickers that I, I believe I got them in my at Hobby Lobby oh, that'd be cute just put a little one up here could be like the greeting now I have a piece that goes on the back, six and three fourths, and this one is by two and three fourths. And it's gonna go right back here to cover the back. Now if you wanna live on the edge, let's flip this one over and put this on the back. Okay, let's put this one like this on the back. Move it around that wet glue gives you a sec and get that pressed down that's so cute okay and actually actually y'all have put it upside down let's do it again 
If I didn't have to turn it over, we'd be at five minutes. But that's okay. Okay, so this is going to be the top right here. I could have left it because they're kind of both all over the place, but I didn't want the gingerbread to be upside down. There we go. So that's super cute. Now just take these right here on this fold and just glue these on. You don't want the money to fall out. Right there. Easy. There you go. I have a little greeting that I pulled out of my stash. I cut some red paper to put it on. I'm going to glue it on the red. Just put whatever you want. Let's get this glued. Let's try to center this up. Let's put it on the front. And there you go. Isn't it super cute? Put a greeting here. You have a greeting out here. It's different on the back. It's absolutely darling. I like it better than the other one. So cute, y'all. So cute. Just take some twine now and just wrap it around to close them up here to be able to have a closure or put some ribbon or make a belly band. It's up to you. Let's just stick some twine. I like to put mine long ways. I wrap it around a couple times. And my little bow. Like I said, you could add some cute little bells to it or something. That'd be a cute little touch. And My, bell, my bow looks a little sad. Let's fix that. And there you go. Seven minute, you got a seven minute uh, money holder there. Anyway, hope you guys like this super quick little idea. I'll put the dimension in the description box below. Hope you guys have a wonderful evening and I'll talk to you soon. Bye.